Hey guys, it's your friendly neighborhood. I, Henry, welcome back to another episode. I'm going back unscripted, just based off of the amount of reviews that I got from it. Um, more specifically, it was 50-50, so I wasn't sure what everyone wanted. So I'll just go back and forth between scripted and unscripted. Um, but for now, what I like to do for review videos is pull up four things that summarize my review and then talk to you guys about it. So just four things, that's it. All right, so here are the four things that we're gonna be talking about with the Apple AirPods. The first is why AirPods. The second is battery life. The third is audio quality and sum it up with the price. So why AirPods? Well, The look that this is what people are wanting but the real reason why people want airpods they don't want to admit that they're actually not bad headphones some people would think otherwise because of the sound quality but the reason why these are the way they are and why you should get airpods is because to connect them and to use them, you simply open the case, you put them in your ears, you close the case, and you start listening to music. You take one earpiece out, pauses music. Put the earpiece back in, resumes music. If you take the other earpiece out, put them both in the case, stops the music. So the fact that the user interface is so simplified and so easy to actually use it, people are buying these off the shelves. So that's why AirPods, because people just want the look, the user interface, and to not speak broke. I mean, I'm I'm speaking broke and I have AirPods, so I don't I don't see I don't I don't see why these are uh so uh so awesome. Sorry. All right, so the second thing is battery life. Now, don't get me wrong. Overall, it's really good battery life. This should last you a couple days. What doesn't last you a couple days are the actual buds. These guys right here. These don't last very long. For my use, whenever I sit down and start working on an art project, either with animation work, um, where I like to listen to jazz music, because that just gets my heart going, when I do that, I usually sit down for about four to six hours at a time, just sitting down, focusing on animation work. These last about almost half of that time before they're just like, hey, I don't have any juice left. Before it had a lot better battery life, but as the years went by with the AirPods, their battery life is just depleted. With the newer AirPods, I haven't heard much of a battery life change when it comes to like the actual user's experience. On the spec sheet, yes, it does say it has better battery life and a bigger battery, but it, it doesn't last that much longer. So kind of a unsmooth transition. Train, train. What? <laughs> words come out of my mouth, come to me words. So let's try to have a smoother transition, shall we? Uh, the next thing is audio quality. Again, people aren't buying these for audio quality. They're buying it for the look and the user experience. When it comes to audio quality, these are not gonna be the high class audio that is gonna beat any other earphones that you ever use. If you use things like Beats earphones, even those will have a different sound quality. I'm not saying these are bad sound quality. They are just different. Different sound quality doesn't mean it's bad quality. It just means that it's different from its competition. When you use AirPods, you are going to really notice the acoustics going around with your music. It's actually quite delightful to listen to music like jazz, singing, and a lot of just instrumental music. When you start to listen to more bass heavy music like workout music, 
that audio quality kind of depletes and you kind of notice the difference between these earphones and other workout earphones, you start to really notice that difference that these don't really have amazing bass. What it does have though is amazing sound quality with phone calls. Whenever I've ever made a phone call with these, everyone just comments on how it sounds cl more clear than what my phone actually produces. And I've had several phones from when I originally got these to the phone I have now. They always say that the AirPods sound better. So a lot of times whenever I get a phone call, I'll always pick up the AirPods because I know everyone's gonna be able to hear me. Even when I'm driving around in traffic on the way to work and someone calls me, they can hear me just fine with the AirPods. So that really leads on to the final thing, which is the price. Bear with me. These are cheap. I know, right? You're, you're like, what? Cheap? No, I, I don't speak broke. I don't understand what you mean. Y you know what you're buying when you get these. You're not looking for the best sound quality headphones. You're looking for something that you can simply take out of your pocket, put in your ears and be done. No buttons. Well, sort of. There is a button on the back, but you literally only use this to reset the device or pair it to a non-Apple device. That's really the only times you'll ever use that button. Um, this is a simultaneous connection with your iCloud devices, but you don't even need that button to do that. All you gotta do is put them in your ears, go to the AirPlay option on one of your iCloud devices and select your AirPods and you're done. Now, they don't connect right away, which is somewhat frustrating when you're doing this several times a day where you're swapping back and forth between your, let's say your computer and your iPhone all day. It can get kind of frustrating and take more time than it needs to. With the newer AirPods, they are gonna be substantially faster than these, but they're still, you're, you're probably going to meme this guys, but uh, these are cheap though. What, competition wise, I'm not saying like, oh, you can't find $20 headphones on Amazon that aren't any good. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying you can't find something better, cheaper than this that looks exactly like it. You probably will. But for what you're actually getting out of this, I don't know any headphones that will provide the same user interface that these do, like to par. Find one pair of headphones that does everything exactly that this one does. It doesn't have to be with an Apple iPhone. It can be with a Android phone, but like 100% does exactly what this does. Let me know in the comments down below and I'll make a video about those earphones. Well, that clears it for this episode. If you like what you saw, please go ahead and like and share this video. And until next time, watch some of my other videos. Matane.